Yo, 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 what's up? This is Jeremy from Joy Generation. Go to the beach. Capital of the state, baby. I'm hoping that this is a little bit better on clarity. Because I have acquired, well, I've had it for a while now, this microphone. So the mic is right here. So let's hope this goes good. So let's start over. Yo, 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 what's up? This is Joe from Jake Generation, right there in the beach. Capital of the state, baby. Don't be mad. All right, so what I got right here in front of me, Jay? Well, this right here is a C10 LS engine swap kit. All right? So this kit comes with motor mounts. Okay. Comes with two motor mounts. Comes with two hardware mounts that goes into the frame. All right, I have two of those. They're very nice and powder coated. Um, they did a pin. I I was told that's called a pin wheel. So this piece here had a notch that dropped down into this piece, and then it was welded here, here, and there. And same thing on this one. Um, that's that. Here's the other one. Very nice. Nice power coated. And then here's the hardware. Um, so you have grade eight fine thread right there. Then you have regular grade five bolts there. All right. Now, the next piece I have is transmission mount. Now, the truck already has engine mounts. And transmission mounts that has an issue doesn't sit exactly where I'd like it to sit. So this kit is supposed to resolve those issues. So let's hope so. So these are the pieces that actually go into the frame box. Has a lot of adjustment here on the top. Um, in fact, let's just see how much it does have. So the whole slots are two and a half. So you got a two and a half inch, you got two and a half inch slot. So that means if it's two and a half inch slot, that means half of two and a half is two inch and a quarter. So you have an inch and a quarter this way, and you have an inch and a quarter this way. Um, on the side mounts here, you have, let's see, these are, these slots here are one inch. So you have a half inch back and forward, all right? So you have two of these, all right? And here is actually the transmission mount itself. Um, it's not really heavy, um, it's real sturdy. Um, it looks like it's in a couple pieces. Um, here's the transmission mount slots. They are two and three quarter. So you got half of two is one and then half of three quarters, three eighths. So you have an inch and three eighths of slot that way. All right. It also is notched out for up to a three inch exhaust and it does not come with a transmission mount. And the reason why is because they don't know what transmission you're running. I'm running a five speed, so I can just run with the hardware and get a five speed mount and be good to go. So, um, Right here on the ticket, it says, beat the Monday rush, order on Saturday and Sunday for fast delivery. Uh, I will say this, I ordered it on the second and it processed and shipped out on the third and I got it yesterday. So, which LMC was that fast? Um, and also here's the hardware for the cross member. The engine mounts that are in the truck and the cross member that's in the truck, um, didn't work out for us, but it might work out for you. So if you're interested in it, um, let me know. I'll definitely be putting it online here shortly, putting it on for sale. Um, but once I get this in, this is gonna help tremendously. Um, gotta get the chassis out of storage and go from there and have a lot of parts. Uh, the client has got a lot of parts that he brought me, a lot. Um, Engine wire and harness, controller, injectors, 
um, Dakota Digital, gauges, air conditioner system. There is a lot of stuff. So um, real excited about that. Um, everybody's complaining about it's cold. Um, yes, it's cold. Um, but before you know it, everybody will be crying it's too hot. But I tell you this, us guys in the body shop world, uh, we don't mind it's hot. Cold is a different story. It, it puts a damper on things. Um, when you have to force heat something to get it warm to do what you need to do, it doesn't work out good. So um, if you have any questions um, on this, uh, I'll have another video once you're installing it. And I appreciate every single one of you. Um, don't worry about the man up the road. Don't worry about the man down the road. And what that means is, don't worry about the man up the road. He's got 86,400 seconds. And the man down the road has 86,400 seconds. And I have 86,400 seconds. Don't worry about how the man up the road is spending his 86,400 seconds. And don't worry about the man down the road spending his, how he spends his 86,000. Don't worry about how I spend my 86,400 86, seconds. The whole meaning behind that is worry about your porch before you worry about somebody else's porch. If you do that, I promise you, you'll be a whole lot better. So we all can do better, including myself. We can all do better. So. Don't worry about the man up the road. Don't worry about the man down the road. Sweep off your own front porch where I'm sweeping off anybody else's. Put God first at Lucy and Drag, Peace, Southern Chicken, Grace, and Maps.